All right, guys, we just made out like bandits. I'm freaking surprised. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. Walking inside the Dollar Tree. It is pretty late and uh, it looks a little busy. Hopefully, we're getting some good deals today. Here we go. We got some movies, some horror movies. The Lingering Broil. Okay, so what we're gonna do is sit here and scan every single one of these aftermath that looks kind of cool crocodile hunter <laughs> but you can see i'm shaking like a leaf pretty neat woody allen Ooh, that looks neat too the night shift okay so i'm gonna start scanning with the amazon seller app and see what we can find and i'll come back on here when i have a little stack hopefully let's do it so here's a great example we have this broken sword hero that i have scanned in right here you can see the rank's not horrible, but selling for $16.98, you'll make $9.93 now. Everything's a dollar each, so that's over an $8 profit right there. Uh, we have another one underneath that's good as well, so I'm just going to keep going through them. There's even some Blu-rays mixed in here that could be pretty good too. So let me show you guys exactly how I'm doing this. I'll pull out a movie like this, and then I'll pull up my Amazon Seller app. And on the app, there is a camera function. So I'll scan in the picture and take a look at that. There it is on DVD. Selling for $18.99. Your fee breakdown is right there. Now these all cost a dollar, so knock a dollar off of that. We're at $10.64. So that is a great one right there. And now I know to look for this in all these racks guys we are finding a lot of very good movies in here uh, we got a bunch of these wolves i'll show you guys how much you'll make on these now the reason why i'm scanning the pictures is because a lot of the barcodes have a uh sticker over them like that you can see the sticker i mean this one you can still see the barcode but the majority of stickers over so i like to just take a picture of the front so let's do it with this wolves dvd right here and you guys will see it pop up. There it is. Great rank. This one's only selling for $9.99. Oh, actually $14.97. So you'll make $8.22 minus your dollar, $7.22. Pretty sweet. Great scores right here so far. All right, guys, we just made out like bandits. I'm freaking surprised. <laughs> this is uh, pretty cool. Lots of good stuff in here lots of potential profits as you guys can see we are jam-packed i didn't expect to find this much i was scanning for a while so uh we're gonna keep looking but i only have three percent battery on my phone but projected profit here is a lot let's uh keep checking this place out here we go we got some toys got some hulk masks some star wars masks these might be cool let's see do they have a barcode they do okay let's check out these little star wars masks I mean, it's December, but people buy masks all year round, right? Let's see, let's scan it in, see if anything comes up. Nothing, so that's fine. We'll just put it back, but that's still pretty cool. I assume the same for the Hulk mask. Uh, I like to check out the book section, so we're gonna make our way around to the books because this toy section's looking a little empty. Here we go. This is what I like to see. So we got a whole bunch of coloring books, paint with water, SpongeBob books. Here's a bunch of coloring, adult coloring books and things like that. We have some crossword puzzles, some Bibles. Bibles can be pretty decent, um, but most of the actual books are missing. So I don't know. What do we have down here? We have some 2020 sticker collection. It's kind of cool. Oh, it's just an album. Same with this Fortnite album down here. So there's no stickers included. Uh, I'm going to do some scanning in here. See if we can find anything. Again, I only have a very little battery, guys. Tip number a thousand. Always have your phone fully charged. Here we go. This little Paw Patrol paint with water back there is worth something. We scanned it in. There it is. Paw Patrol 787. The fees are 388. You'll make 399. The rank is very good. 86,000 in toys for you know about a two dollar three dollar profit it's gonna be a three dollar profit on each one so i'll just grab a little stack of them i'll leave some behind but we'll take a few of those why not let's check spongebob who is that blue from blue's clues we'll check all those now 
So I did just look up the SpongeBob one, guys, and take a look. It has a very good rank also, but it's only selling for five sixty-seven. You'll still make a dollar twelve, so there is you can still double your money, right? Uh, I'm gonna leave them behind, but if I did choose to take them, you know that's one dollar for each one of these, right? So that's a quick four bucks just sitting right there. They're very easy to prep and ship off to Amazon. It takes almost no time at all. Uh, we'll look up little Paw Patrol puppy right there, and blue this puppy right here ended up being worth something take a look at that uh, very good Rankin toys selling for $7.51 you'll make $3.68 so that's a $2.68 profit on each I grabbed three of them so you know two four six about seven to eight dollars right there pretty easy pretty easy money right there this all adds up really fast guys now guys I've seen some videos of people actually buying and flipping food from the dollar store that can work too um, you just got to come down the aisles and find interesting looking things like these non-gmo crispy onions scan those in see if they're worth anything um, you always got to pay attention to the expiration date this is good for about a year so this is fine um, but always pay close attention to the expiration date and not only that but the net weight so dollar stores sometimes you can see the net weight on this is 2.8 ounces dollar stores sometimes have lower net weight than average so if you're selling on amazon keep an eye out make sure that the net weight matches the listing online um, i'm not going to mess with any food this time because my cart is completely full guys we got so many movies we got a whole bunch of these activity books uh, i'm gonna take another quick look around but my phone is on one percent so we are running low on time but hopefully we still can find one more item in here i might take a quick look at the snacks the little snack out could be cool and also sometimes they have trading cards here so you can find um, sports cards or you could find Pokemon cards or anything cool like that so definitely keep an eye out for that kind of stuff looking around at the office supplies here I found something branded and this is interesting paper mate uh, has a decent amount of reviews selling for $5.99 you'd only make a buck 39 but again if you bought a whole bunch of them you're making a quick buck 39 each now obviously this can't be the only thing that you sell because you're not going to make a lot of money but it's good to have a few little fillers in your store like this is kind of cool color sense scented felt tip pens um, I don't know if this is online so we're going to scan it in together all right here we go scan up that barcode and it is online but we're gonna pass because the rank is super high nobody's really buying this stuff online uh, plus you wouldn't even make enough money to recoup your costs so this we'll put back on the shelf here we go i found another paper mate branded item right here we have five of those um clicky pencils <laughs> the ones where you click and the lead comes out We'll take a quick look at this, scan this in. All right, let's see, popped up right away and it's actually not on Amazon, so that's okay. We'll leave that behind and you know, that'll happen with a lot of things. We have here some glitter pens, check those out real fast. See if anything comes up there, nothing. So that's okay too. <laughs> not finding too much in the office supplies section of the dollar store, the Dollar Tree. These are kind of cool. We've got some Toy Story 4 sticker sheets. Now, it's not always about individual products. You could find a few different things with the same brand like Toy Story and make a lot. Make a bundle, sell them on eBay, that works too. Here we go, we got some calendars here. We got Dr. Seuss and My Little Pony, Transformers. These are cool. Uh, you want to get them into Amazon and listed on eBay right away because it's almost the end of 2021. So I guess I'll look them up real fast. There it is. Again, it's a pretty quick double up, a little more than double your money. So it's possible. There's a lot of them there. Something that I've actually sold from here before are their little puzzles. These are not on Amazon from what I can find, but they actually do semi-decently on eBay. So we have these Bob Ross puzzles right here. Um, I'm not sure, that's just some food on a grill. Uh, but of course, you know, Ariel from Little Mermaid, My Little Pony, these are all pretty well-known cartoon characters and you could lot them up on eBay, you know, pay a dollar each, get four of them, right? Get some Disney princesses together. You got two right there. You got a bunch right here, right? You lot them all up and 
your $1 each can turn into $5 each, right? You get a lot of four for $4, sell them for, I don't know, 20 bucks, $19.99 shipped, and they do sell. They do sell. It's, it's kind of crazy. It's a little... Oh, that's Alice in Wonderland, I just realized. That's okay, though. Here's a whole bunch of Crayola stuff. We got little Crayola drawing mats, a little velvet poster drawing, a 3D wood toy. These are all things that you could lot up, right? Here's a whole paint kit for $1. You throw that together with a few of these, ask five each in a big lot, $15 for all three. It'll sell. These are kind of interesting also. We got Cheetos, Mac and Cheese, Cheesy Jalapeno, Flamin' Hot, and Bold and Cheesy. You can make a bundle of all three, or these could even sell on places like Amazon as well, uh, especially in bundles of two. You get two of each, right? So now your $2 buy cost can turn into more profit. That's always an option also. I just don't wanna mess with food right now. Um, again, like I said, I have so many hard goods right here. I'd rather not be selling food at the moment. I think it was a pretty profitable stop. I'm very happy about it, guys. Oh, another great thing before we leave. I have sold these in the past like crazy. These little uh, singles to go. We got Cherry 7-Up, Sunkissed, Wires. These things sell pretty well. I definitely recommend looking them up. We also have Monster Oat Milk. I have never seen this. That's another thing. You come to these discounted stores and they get a whole bunch of really weird things that get discontinued in main stores. So you could actually find things uh, that make a really good profit because people are looking for this and you can't find it at the gas station or at the supermarket. And uh, maybe only a dollar store where I am in Connecticut carries this. I'm not sure. I don't go to other dollar stores in other states, but it's a possibility. All right guys, so we are going to head out of here. I think I got more than enough stuff. Let's head home. Wow, 134.